middle bit here and use the big, the big broom up there and just sweep it backwards and forwards and it dissolves really, really quickly. Right. And that's really all you have to do. This and uh, hydro, you put hydrochloric acid in as well. So, so um, occasionally. How much, how often? Tell you, yeah. when, if you take it in, the poor people will say, Oh, well, they'll say you, you it's. Need 440 mil of hydrochloric or 250 mil. Same time, put your salt in. Yep. Okay. Or, or sometimes you don't need salt, they'll say salt's high, don't worry about that. But you need a top up of acid, like a cup of acid or something. All right. And there's some, I hate it. It's, it's oh. counterintuitive uh, going oh. jumping in a pool full of yeah. dilute yeah. acid. When we had our first pool in Canberra, I thought, I'm putting acid in the pool and my kids are going to jump in. Yeah. So I used to get the a stick and swirl it around, which is why I put it in here. The book will tell you that you should dilute it into a bucket of water and then walk all around the pool putting it in. Yeah, because if you spill a drop of it, it's going to going to eat through. I've got holes in some of my shirts. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I'm very, very careful. But I dump it in there right in front of that an outlet. Oh, so it, it gets pushed, pushed out. out the pool. Yeah. It, I just think of high school chemistry.